right into it. Uh, this is Scott, the obviously better looking Cloud Brother here. Uh, finished the stream with my brother tonight and uh, he was having trouble getting into the EC2 instance. And you guys can't see it, but it is 9.32 p.m. right now and I said this should take me about 10 minutes. So I'm going to see how, uh, how close I am to that. So with no further ado, let's get started. EC2, I don't, I don't know if I'm logged in or not, uh, probably not. Okay, I'm going to move this down a little bit. Uh, yeah, root user, I'll probably block that out. This stuff, we all love this stuff. Three, one, four. Oh, and because of these last pass, I have this already. Probably blur that out too. Oh, yeah, if you use Amazon, one of the tricks is to look at the, the logo. This is the store. This is AWS. And then my muffle code. Bear with me here. I don't know if this counts towards my time or not. I guess it does. success okay uh, Windows instance launch instances I want a Windows 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 what how do I get Windows again do I just type Windows up here is there all oh there's one uh, that the free tier one Let's do, yeah, let's just do one of the first Windows ones. Windows Server 2019 for what the hell? Oh, it is free tier eligible. Yes. Okay. Okay. So I'm still going to do free tier because all I'm doing is showing uh, how to log into this bad boy. So I'm just going to go through all the defaults. <coughs> um, I don't want this to be accessible from anywhere. I'm just going to change it to my own IP address. And then review and launch and launch. And I do have this key and block that out as well, but I have that. And so I'm going to launch it. So Windows takes a couple of seconds here, so bear with me while uh, I edit this little chunk out. Or maybe I leave it. I don't know. So it says it's running, but I can't connect to it yet because it's still doing its thing. And Windows takes a little longer than EC2. And I'm at 9.36 right now. Ah, 
the other clue here is it's also in pending state as well. So I don't think I have any other EC2s running. and uh, put some nice uh, copyright-free smooth jazz over this part. Also, it's a T2 micro and I forgot about that. Um, I wanted to do it faster. I should have made a, a bigger instance, but whatever. Not gonna cry, cry over a uh, spilled pie. on mute <laughs> um, I'm going back to this thing so explain this again 939 so still roughly 10 minutes um, this is the purpose of this video is to show you how to get the password for your Windows instance and you click on connect click on RDP you click on oh sorry not that one you click on get password and then you need to associate this key pair uh, that you have here and let's go to shirts and downloads oh I'll blur out all the pictures I don't think it matters no they're not dirty they're just private um what is that one mug for yeah there it is so i want that you click on that and then it gives you insert your key into there and then you click decrypt password and there's your password bingity bangity boom and then you click copy and this actually should bring up RDP, although, although uh, I'm on the Mac, so I don't really have a client and really think about that. But um, you use your RDP, which isn't the purpose of this video. Purpose, that's a different video. But uh, you click on, and you can do that every time, right? You just have to make sure you have the SSH key and that's the key for being able to decrypt. So you can also do it this way too. Go connect, RDP client, get password, browse. I might redo this with the, out the stuff on there, but I know I can do it in 10 minutes. Uh, yeah, yeah, there you go, AWS. and then decrypt password could also make that into a little tiktok 
anyway, that's it for now from Scott, the obviously much better looking Cloud Brother.